All right, well, now it's time to get started with the test. So you come and sit down here. And I know I said this is a test, but really your role, all we need you to do is operate it and play with it in essence. Okay. Now, in your role as kind of a video game writer and things, do you ever do beta tests? Yeah. Yeah, pretty, pretty regularly? Constantly. Constantly, mm -hmm. okay. So think of this as kind of like a beta test <laughs> of yep. sorts, where the whole idea behind this, um, Lucky Martin had this idea of let's test and see how commercial technology can work and operate in deep space in a much harsher environment than what we have here on Earth. Well, right now, if you were to ask Alexa, um, just like you practice, go ahead and ask and let's see if uh, Alexa can give us the information. Alexa, how far away is Earth right now? Currently, Orion's 222,579 miles away from Earth. <laughs> That's so cool. Yes. You just sent your voice up to space. Intimidating. Yeah, 222,000 miles away. Very so. cool. Alexa, what point on Earth are you over right now? Using Orion's current geodetic latitude and longitude location data calculated by onboard guidance, navigation, and control software, Orion is currently over South Atlantic Ocean. South Atlantic. I was hoping for Australia. <laughs> yeah, I was going to ask, is there you. a way that I could <laughs> ask how far off Australia it is? I wouldn't know how to phrase that. Yeah. That, that's one that we haven't built in for this test, okay. but because we have access to the vehicle data, that could be a potential intent. Gotcha. Alexa, how fast is Orion going? Orion's current relative velocity to Earth is 2,731 miles per hour. For your personal time, we're actually going to initiate a call. Mm -hmm. So we're actually going to have you initiate this call. Okay. And it's very, very difficult. You have to push this call Orion button. I'm not going to mess anything up. You're not going to mess anything up. What did you do? <laughs> no, you're, you're, you're absolutely good. The tablet up in space from this camera is now going to take your likeness and you are going to be in space. Wow. This is your astronaut moment. Mm. Do you know what you're going to do? We're waving. <laughs> We're waving to our... It's the first thing you do. It's the first thing you do. So you are officially in space right now. Wow. <laughs> How do I get my dog in space? We can. So one of your friends, who would you put up in, in space that you'd want to communicate with? Oh, it's got to be my mom. It's yeah. your mom? Yeah. Okay. You will notice that it is now appearing up on the tablet in space. If your mom is in space, then she would be able to write back and... <laughs> so would this ever actually be used? Uh, that is kind of the idea and why we're doing this test, mm -hmm. is to be able to use this application in more of a, a practical real world. So let's say uh, your mom just took this picture mm -hmm. and she is going to say, okay, um, she needs to get from this landing zone uh, where they want to land and needs to set up base camp over here. Mm -hmm. So she needs to communicate with the foremost expert on the lunar surface, which is you. She's been gravely misinformed. Yeah, she's <laughs> if you can provide a recommended path you want her to take, you can kind of see how your collaboration and expertise here on Earth mm. can then be shared with the crew on board. Okay, I'm not trying to kill her, but uh, I think she'd, she'd enjoy the hike. Yeah, uh, no, this is, this, is, this is the right thing because everything, your expertise here has shown up on the tablet in space. Cool. I know for a fact you use Alexa in your home I pretty do. regularly. Yeah. What do you use Alexa to control in your home? I play a lot of music. Alexa, play your favorite song. And I'm talking to you. Now you gotta get your group on in space. <laughs> Do you ever dance on your streams and like? Absolutely not. No. Okay, you're like, I no, wish. I, no. I, yeah, I, I play nerd. games. I write. <laughs> I don't dance. So other things that I do at home is like set a timer, control mm -hmm. lighting. Yes, you can control the lighting. Okay, Alexa, change the lights to blue. Okay. You've now commanded the lights to change inside of the Orion vehicle. 222,000 miles away. It's unfathomable. Uh, it is. So we're going to have you do one last thing because I understand you are a fairly big uh, comic and superhero fan. Do you, sure, have, yeah. do you have a favorite? It's Batman. It's Batman. Yeah. Okay. You say to the Batmobile. We should see if we program something fun in here. Alexa, to the Batmobile. Done and done and done and Batman. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> well, cool. Thank you so much. Thank you for um, having me.